fair it's like a small little fair it's not like big state fair but it's a small like little hometown fair but it's perfect for us i like it better than the big fair because it's so much walking and crowded gosh i have a big old driveway sorry my ADHD is kicking in your ADHD but actually we're not that far it's right there I thought we were far away from it, but it's actually literally right there about to turn in and park. But today is the last day. So if you come, you all get um, wristbands yeah. where you can ride the rides like as many as you want or whatever. So I have a feeling my kids are going to ride one ride. <laughs> Mommy, I'm Stand in. Along time. You see? Yeah, I'm right. Going to go? Yeah. Uh, I was Huge? Yeah. Oh. 53. I wonder if that one o'clock thing starts right at one. Oh, I know. I meant when we end, when we're in. Because people are really going to start becoming ill. Okay. One time I went to a fair, they had like this cage and people riding motorcycles in it doing like going upside down. Maybe it's because they can't play on a bunch of rides because they're too little. But at least they can ride the clothes thing. Why is that fun? Is that the 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 fun?
She would have been fine with Bella. That's what Riley was. We always ride that together. But it would go slower than that. No, it's not. That's how fast it's going to go. Are you doing it, Riley? Are you doing it? You can try? Where's my exit? Come on. Come on, Amy, Layla. Get your hands on now. Go see the puppy. Amy, get beside him. Bella Riley, turn. It, Layla. Cheese. Cheese. Okay. Good job. Look, Layla. Say thank you. You say thank you? <laughs> Tell the puppy bye. Say bye. Layla, say bye bye. Bella, what you got? Let me see. What you got? Look. Can your hair not fit in it? Hold on. Like that. Look, now it sits. Look, look at me. Hold on, baby. Don't drag it all out. Crush it up.
Is that blue? Is it good? Better than green? Better than green? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh no! But <laughs> same. This is future me. <laughs> I'm actually editing this. Um, it has been a long day itself. But um, you saw this seatbelt that was like dragging that Brad even noticed. Well, we didn't know what was going on, but the ride went around like it normally would, Mom. came down. All the parents went to the exit, you know, thinking their kids were getting off. The oh, yeah. person working it, yes, baby. Okay, the person working it went to the middle of where the kids were and he was like looking down and looking down and then he went back over to his station, started it back up, the ride went to click click and it like went halfway up and it just like was like clicking and like going in a circle. So we were like really confused. Um, we sat there for a while, we were still confused about what was going on. And then it kept going in circles. And we're like, this is a really long ride. And then I started to get a little antsy. And I'm like, is something wrong? Like, literally, why are they not um, coming down? So he kept going in a circle. Going in a circle. And so I was like, something's not right. And other parents started to come over because they were noticing that the ride was going for a long time. <laughs> you know, it's a little kid ride. I'm like, they're going to get dizzy. And then kids started crying. Thankfully, Bella was on there with Emmy. So... It was able to like you know keep her calm and like laughing you know they had no idea what was going on but other kids um that were smaller started crying a little boy actually went around the circle and said lit us off and i was like okay and I, you know i was kind of talking out loud but not directly to the person but i was like okay my kids my kids want to get off and i was like brad like i don't want them to keep going in circles and then he went back over to the thing, looked at it, went back to the thing. He went around like three more times. And then he went back to his little station he kept looking at. And then he went back and he brought him down. The only thing I can think of, and I don't know how, the seatbelt was on the other side of like, you know, the outer part of the ride. I don't know if that somehow, maybe the other side had a seatbelt hanging down too. And we just couldn't see it. If maybe that got tangled somehow. I don't know, but clearly something was wrong because they were stuck on it for a good 10 minutes and the ride only lasts for like two minutes. So something had happened, but I just don't know what, but that's the part that they had got little, you know, got, got stuck on. But thankfully my kids didn't really understand it or realize it. So um, they were fine, but I know other kids that were younger were getting really upset and then I was getting aggravated, but... It just goes to show like with all these types of rides and these fairs, like you just never know. You see all the horror stories that are going on and like the videos of people getting stuck upside down or people like falling off of stuff. Like it's horrible. So I think sadly about that stuff when we go to these types of um, fairs and things like that, I just think about things like that. It's sad we have to, but we kind of have to because things nowadays is just, it's so hard to trust that these things, you know, are gonna work properly. Oh, it actually died while we were out, but I didn't get to record them. After the last ride, um, Bella and Daddy, Bella and Brad went on this like ride called the taxi ride. And it was this ride and it spun in circles and like went around in circles. Blech. So when they got off, they were like super dizzy. And Bella was like, I was dizzy on that ride, but then I was fine. And then Brad, he said he got super dizzy on it. And 
I don't like those. I don't like the rides that you get on and you just get nauseous and sick afterwards. Um, but then we ended up playing a few games. Um, Bella played a balloon dart throwing game. Riley did too. They were very sweet and the toys they won, they gave to Layla and Emmy. So that was super sweet. Riley did like some kind of shooting thing where you have to shoot out a star and so did Brad. And like the man told us the trick is, is to get the outside first so it'll fold in. A lot of people just try to like get the star and then it kind of like the paper will start to mess up and you can't get it but he said if you go around the outside it'll like make just like a big hole and then it'll chunk out the star so that made sense um so they didn't win but they had fun playing it and then Isabella played what else did she play she played the darts Bella what other game did you play oh you want to show him he must have heard me talking but this is what it looked like I think that's Riley's and then this is daddy so he oh he was so close but it, it was more of like trying to instead of like holding out the the star it would be better to like fold the paper around I mean, it. it was rigged because the um they loosen the trigger Layla, come in here they loosen the trigger to where you can't single fire it so it's gonna pull it all around. um and then bella played one more game she played the balloon the game uh, nerf gun game nerf gun game so she got to stand on a little stool and she got a nerf gun she got three shots and she had to hit the red solo plastic cups. Layla, come here, off. And she did knock one off and then she didn't get the other, but she still got a prize and she got a pink elephant. And I'm surprised she got like a really actually nice sized pink elephant. Um, normally they give you like really small things, but. When I, when I did the balloon game, it ricocheted off and almost hit me. Yeah, and then when Le yeah when Bella was doing the dark game, it um flew back, and um I had my bag right in front of Layla, and thank goodness I did because it bounced off my bag and it would have hit her. I don't know what it would have done, but yeah, the dark game was kind of scaring me. Um, but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, thank you to all my new subscribers. We love and appreciate you guys so 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 much. Like so much we're almost at a thousand if i get to a thousand you know i just want to be able to help out and pay some grocery bills some light bills a phone bill i just want to be able to help out money wise a little bit so it'll be super nice to get to a thousand i'm trying really hard but i love and appreciate guys so much if you haven't already and you want to join our family hit the subscribe button get us to a thousand i'm going to be doing a giveaway at a thousand but i just really want to get to a thousand subscribers we're almost there guys i think we have like 300 and that's that's a lot when you're a small channel 300 people is a lot um but if you want to join our family hit the subscribe button don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you like our videos it helps out our little channel tremendously just by hitting that like button just by leaving comments down below it helps you to push our videos please it helps you to push our videos out but anyways if you do want to join our family, we would really appreciate it. And I appreciate all of you that have joined and subscribe and watch our videos and support our family. We love you guys so much. And we will see you in our next video. Bye, guys.